Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. When I'm showing new users about uh, the computer, one of the first things I show them how to do is use the clipboard. And the clipboard is this invisible place on your computer where you can cut, copy things to items like text or photos, images, whatever, and then you can paste from. Cut, copy, and paste. On Windows, it's as simple as a keyboard shortcut, control X cuts, control C is copy, and control V is paste. And you can think of V paste kind of like a, you know, like remember Elmer's glue that we all used to eat back in, in kindergarten? Okay, well, well I, I used to eat it. Anyway, you can do the same command on the Macintosh as well. It, it also uses, well, instead of using the control key, it's actually the, uh, the command key. Uh, command C, X, and V do copy, cut, and paste. So it's, it's very familiar uh, to most people if you've used a Mac before or Windows. They're, they're, they're similar. Every, every operating system has got a clipboard. The problem is you can only store one object or one item at a time on a clipboard by default. And Conjulo... <laughs> And I'm, believe me, I'm trying to pronounce these names from the chat room at live.perillo.com correctly. So if I don't, I apologize. Was asking for a utility for Windows that would allow you to extend the functionality of the clipboard to allow you to cut and copy many items, uh, not just having one in the clipboard at one point in time. The utility I happen to use is Clipboard Plus. Oh, thank you. I'm getting better at it. Uh, Clipboard Plus is a utility that comes with CFI shell toys. It's not free, but it's very unobtrusive. I have it programmed to pop up my Clipboard Manager if I hit Windows Z. Now, you can't do that because you may not have the software, but that's how I have it set up. Uh, this now stores up to 500 items on my clipboard, images, text, and, and what have you. If I wasn't using Clipboard Plus, I would be using Clip Cash Pro, uh, which has been around for quite a while, and it's like, it is like the uber clipboard manager. I mean, you would not believe how much stuff you cut, copy, and paste on a regular basis. And with Clip Cash Pro, you can more easily manage uh, sets of information and you can organize things. I, I really don't need the clipboard to do that so much. Some people who do a lot of routine or, or mundane tasks would appreciate uh, the power management features of, of ClipCash Pro. Uh, for the Mac, there is iClip and uh, that is, uh, some people who use the Mac on a regular basis swear by it, but since I'm not really on OS X very frequently, or at least in terms of using it often, I really don't rely on third-party managers. Uh, Condulo, the guy who asked about this Windows clipboard, had mentioned a couple of Linux utilities. Um, so they're, they're clipboard managers for just about every operating system that you can think of. Now, if you happen to have a favorite clipboard manager, uh, ooh, I forgot. There's a free or one called Yankee Clipper. Uh, they've actually they've, that's the old version of it. They've got a newer version of it, which is just 15 bucks. But I forgot. I wanted to get that one in there. The freeware the Yankee Clipper for Windows. So anyway, if now if I have not mentioned a, a clipboard utility that you happen to like, by all means share it. Uh, we're always interested in looking at new software. Um, if that, especially if it replaces or does better than the solutions that we currently have in place.